we have uh, Bordel here today. So tell tell uh, tell me how how old you are now, or how young you are this year. Ninety-seven. Ninety-seven. Wow, you are one of my old oldest patients here. Okay. So you're gonna hit hundred pretty soon, right? Mm -hmm. Wow. I asked her what the secret was, but she wouldn't tell me, right? <laughs> you you may have some secrets but i don't know it really mm -hmm. how about your parents did they live a long time uh yeah my uh dad did she, he was in his 90s 90s see mm -hmm. my mother died very young oh is that right mm -hmm. oh okay so you got your dad's genes mm -hmm. so genes are very important obviously mm -hmm. <laughs> okay and then where are you from where'd you grow up i grew up in beaumont texas oh texas okay mm -hmm. You're proud Texan? Pretty, pretty proud. Really? <laughs> mm -hmm. So when did you move out uh, this way? Oh, I've been out here. I've been out here about 50 years. Oh, 50 years? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you actually came when you were a little bit older then? Oh, yes. I was in my very early 20s when I came. Was oh, that right? Mm -hmm. So what got you to move out this way? I have a friend that uh, was here, uh -huh. and she, I had just finished business school, and she said, you need to come to California, Oh, you can get a, a good job. Uh-huh. So you studied business? Yes. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. where, where in uh, Texas, in obviously? In Te Houston. Oh, is that right? Oh, mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. Wow. So, so what did you do when you came out here? You, you found a job? I a very good job, yes. Mm -hmm. I was blessed. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. And then, and then, and then, what did you do after that? Well, I met my husband. Oh, you met your husband, okay? I got married. He, he just got out of service. Oh, is that right? Okay. In the army, and uh, he got married. Mm hmm. And, and then, had children. How many kids did you have? I had four. Oh, you had four. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Obviously, they're all grown up. You got how many grandkids and? I Huh? Not too many? Not too many. Uh-huh. How about great grandkids, right? You have a... A couple. You just have a couple? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Are they locally around here? Or? Yes. They're in, in one... My, my son was settled in New York, mm -hmm. so uh, no grandkids there, but a couple of them did. Oh, I see. So what is your favorite food? What do you eat every day? Not just just regular food. Really? Mm -hmm. What's your favorite? My favorite. Mm. What's your favorite dish? I think my favorite in meat is. You like meat? Yeah. Oh. My favorite is uh, steak. Yeah. So he has some. She has some cows over here. You can see. Move the table up a little bit. Like like steak? You like you like good steak? No, not really. I like roast beef, but not steak. Oh, roast beef? Mm-hmm. Mm. I thought all Texans eat uh, steak. No. My husband likes always like steak. Oh really? Yeah. So I, I just had my preference in beef is like roast beef. Oh, is that right? Roasted, yes. Was he a, was he a Texan or was he was he here in California? He was a Texan. Uh huh. Uh huh. When he got out of the army, he came to California. Oh, I see. Yeah. Wow. That's where I met him. That's yeah. Where I met him. Okay. Mm -hmm. So when when did you retire? Did you? How long ago mm -hmm. I've been retired? For a while. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So what what are you doing? Uh, keeping you busy? What what? Do you walk or do you exercise? I try to. Uh -huh. I don't as much as I should, but mostly walk, and I love working in my yard. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. What are you doing there? You got some? You growing some things or? Not not. Just flowers and. Oh, flowers. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Any edible stuff? No. No. no that's my that's my downfall. I should do, but no edible. Uh-huh. Flowers are nice. 
Real nice. Yeah? What kind of flowers do you have there? Roses. Uh huh. Like the roses. Uh -huh. have, uh, you really have me thinking. <laughs> Sorry, I'm asking a lot of questions. <laughs> yeah. But you look great. I wish I can show your face. Look at you. You look you look like 20, 30 years younger than your age. Yeah, you look great. That's why I was asking what what your secrets are because that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm trying to find out. That's why I'm asking these questions. Obviously, genes are very good uh, uh, starting point, mm -hmm. but uh, what you eat and your yeah. exercise and uh, most important what I find out is the people live long tend to have a really good um, kind personality. They're nice people, you know, they don't have a lot of stress, right? Well, that's nice to hear. I don't know where that get that, but... The, you, you look that way. You look so calm and you know, pleasant, you're smiling all the time, see? Right? People tell you you're, you're nice all the time? Mm -hmm. People tell you, right? Mm -hmm. See? Well, they tell me. I have to take them at that word. <laughs> well, I, I think it's true. You, you, just, you just have this positive smile on you all the time, and you're nice and kind to everybody, and that, that tells a lot about uh, who you are. And I personally think that's your secret, but you're you're humble enough not to say that, right? I don't know whether that's a secret or not. <laughs> well, it's a secret because you know what? Most people don't do it. You know. Okay. Some people do, but most people don't do it, including myself. I'm not pleasant all the time, you know. But but that that's an attitude thing, you know. So I think that's a really good way to live. So. You must walk a lot because you built a lot of houses. <laughs> yeah, well, I do walk a lot. Yeah, that's good. You keep moving, right? Yes. You don't stay still. No. Okay. Because there's always something to do. That's what I'm saying. I think that's one of the secrets. You got to keep moving. You know. So you can see there's a lot of houses still coming. So. Do you live by yourself, or you have a? No, I uh, my daughters live with me. Uh huh. Uh huh. She's in the hospital now, but she's doing nice. We talked well, to her this morning. And really? She's doing okay. What happened? Well, we don't know. The doctors so far have not seen her. Seem to know what's going on. What's wrong with that? Really? I'm mm -hmm. sorry. So there you have it. There were a lot of calluses, but we took care of it. There's a little bit on here, but we just need to clean up a little bit here, and then we're done. Okay, well, Daryl, thank you for allowing us to film this today, and I got some secrets out of you. You <laughs> okay. keep moving. You eat whatever you like to eat. Mm -hmm. You're pleasant and kind and nice person, which really helps uh, your longevity. I personally think so, but uh, thank you, Daryl. Thank you.